Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So continuing with the Express.js and Nanjak series, uh, previously I've shown you how you can get started with uh, Express.js and how to create basic uh, HTML uh, routes and how you can uh, uh, render out routes to uh, specific uh, HTML pages, right? So previously I've shown about uh, home route and about route like you are seeing over here so for this is the about uh, sorry this is the home route and this is the about route so basically what we are doing is what we did in the previous video is we are mentioning get a uh, method over here basically the route which we hit in the browser is a get method and uh, whenever you hit this route on the server start uh, what we are uh, what we are uh, sending was what we were sending was a html page that is a home and about so let's go to those pages so this is the simple page what, uh, which we were sending but uh, now let's move to the part where we are going to use the middleware and we are not going to uh, use app.get method so basically in this video we are going to learn about express.js middlewares so what are middlewares let's go to their official documentation site so express uh, js has a pretty good documentation on whatever they provide as a feature so basically it is a routing way uh, all the routes which you specify is in a specific folder in our case it is going to be a routes folder so over here we are going to use two J, uh, JS files basically based on your routes. How many routes do you have? So for example, in this example, we have home and about route, right? So uh, home has a middleware where we are importing express routers, which is a middleware and it will do get request. And that has a callback, which is a function indeed, which sends a file uh that is home html and similarly uh, we are exporting the router similarly for the about page as well so this are this is the folder where you mention your middleware routes uh yeah middleware routes and you don't have to use it in your app.js like we have did over here so after mentioning the routes, what uh, what you need to initially do is create a folder route and then uh, perform uh, or create two uh, files based on your route home and about and uh, import router uh, router function in your application or JS file and write a code account accordingly to this. So the documentation is provided over here. You can also check this. Uh, for our application in the future we actually don't need require this to use one uh, we can uh, go ahead with this method also but uh, using middlewares and using it within a route routes folder um, shows a clean format of your code so this is pretty a uh, clean format so once you uh, specify your routes within the route folder what you need to do is import those functions basically those are functions only right a callback function what it will do is once you export it from your route js file you just need to import it in your app.js and it will act as a function what the function will do is that it will uh, call that html page on a route get method so whatever we are doing over here we are just mentioning it within a routes uh, middleware using router and uh, we are uh, applying the app dot use to uh, mention the route as a first parameter and the function which will perform that uh, html file on your specific route so let's uh, see what is the output um, all you need to do is just create a folder route and uh, perform this operation so if you also have a route called product you just create another js file and perform this kind of a 
handler by importing a router and the express router and do a get for that route you don't need to mention um, product in this manner or uh, about in this manner you just need to provide a slash and all uh, the handling part of the route is done over here you just need to mention it we are calling the function right so this is the only change we are uh, doing for this uh, in this video for this part right now and I'll just show you the output and uh, let's see the output node app.js so server has started that's 4000 right uh, local host So as you can see, this is our home route. Uh, this is the HTML page uh, which we are rendering. And uh, this is that page within that views folder as we did previously. And this is the about folder and uh, let's go to the about route. So as you can see, this is the about route. and that was uh, home route so this is how you can use the uh, router middleware and app dot use to specify your routes at a particular in a particular folder within a js file right so this is how you can use your uh, middleware routes and use it within app dot js like this so um, this was it for this video guys in the next video uh, we'll be looking into async parallel and uh, we'll be looking into how you can uh, get the header in the footer part irrespective of your routes right so even if you hit uh, about or home irrespective of that uh, those route your header and footer should be loaded right so we'll be looking into async parallel and how you can perform that and uh, if you have any questions and queries regarding this you can comment down below the code uh, will be available in the description explore this documentation on the react uh, sorry the express middlewares will get a better idea and uh, yep this was it for this video guys and in uh, next video we'll be looking uh, we'll get uh, started with the nunjux part and how you can use the header footer and uh, bring the home and about page as well. So Yep, this was it for this video guys if and you if you have any questions and queries you can comment down below all the necessary things will be available in the description and uh, Stay tuned for more Thanks for watching